Shame is another kind of force, actually. It's the force of do it or else, stop it or else. And it originates in modern parenting methods that leverage the child's mammalian need for parental acceptance and the child's mammalian fear of parental abandonment. Punishment, it's not so much the physical pain that is effective on the child. It's the, it's the obvious repudiation of the child in that moment. So, so this is a type of, of primal force. It's the force of a gun to your head, do it or else, because that is the survival fear that is triggered through punishment or, or even like approval. <laughs> uh, when a, approval is used manipulatively, uh, I accept you because you do this, I reject you because you do that. What's wrong with you? You're bad, you're, you're horrible, horrid little brat. That kind of language is operating on survival fear. But actually, there's one other part of shame though. All of these uh, expressions of our separation also have a seed of something else. Even shame, uh, in a healthy culture, shame is the realization of a disconnect between what you've actually been doing and who you, who you actually are. And when that is exposed, the false self-image dissolves, liberating heat, and there's a flush to the face. And if, that, if, they're, if you're being held in total unconditional acceptance, then you're free to have that experience and to realize where you have been out of alignment with, with who you really are. Uh, however, like so many beautiful and good things, it has been perverted uh, into an instrument of aggression, oppression, control, domination. And that's actually a kind of a trauma too. You know, we can talk about the, the aces and the, the overt trauma, but in a way trauma is normalized in our society. Yeah, none, none of that happened to me, but on a more muted level, Trauma is pretty much written into the fabric um, of our civilization because it draws on paradigms of the conquest of nature, the conquest of the self, rising above materiality, spirit and uh, body in opposition, um, like all of these deep paradigms that are, that are changing right now.